So footage revealed that an armed school resource officer stood outside Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School during the shooting and never went inside the building. Authorities say it was Scott Peterson's duty to go inside and address the situation. Peterson was later suspended and he resigned. Also, Florida state legislature rejected a motion to debate a bill to ban assault rifles. This was not even the bill. It was a motion to see if they would debate the bill. No. The students from the school traveled to the state capital of Tallahassee to lobby the lawmakers. Last Wednesday, CNN's Jake Tapper hosted a town hall meeting about gun control called Stand Up, the Students of Stoneman Douglas Demand Action. Answering the questions were Florida Senators Marco Rubio and Bill Nelson. One survivor repeatedly asked Rubio if he'll continue to accept money from the NRA, and he pretty much ducked the question. Awkward. They spoke about limited high-capacity rifles and loopholes. Speaking of the NRA, a bunch of companies are now cutting ties with them. But guess who wasn't there? However, he sat notes in hand with survivors and parents. They spoke about tougher background checks, mental health screenings for gun buyers, and suggested arming teachers with guns. Teachers were like, as in glue guns? Arm me with books. Arm me with a better library. Pencils. Although you can stab with a pencil. Of course, conspiracy theorists are having a blast with this, but out of respect for all the victims of this tragedy, I will not add fuel to the fire. Bye-bye, Felicia.